Hello everyone, today we will talk about the grammatical error that we used to do very often in our daily life. Our first wrong sentence is, we discussed about the problem so thoroughly. It is the wrong sentence. So, what is the correct sentence? The correct sentence is, we discussed the problem so thoroughly. Our another wrong sentence is, an Indian ship laden with merchandise got drowned in the Pacific Ocean. So, it is a wrong sentence, but its correct sentence is, an Indian ship laden with merchandise sank in the Pacific Ocean. Our next sentence is, the Indian radio which was previously controlled by the British ruler is free now from the narrow wasted interest. So, it is the wrong sentence. And the correct sentence is, the Indian radio which was previously controlled by the British ruler is now free. In wrong sentence, it is free now. In the correct sentence, it is now free from the narrow vested interest. So, let's move on to the next wrong sentence. And it is, if I had known this yesterday, I will have helped him. But it is a wrong sentence. So, the correct sentence is, if I had known this yesterday, I would have helped him. Not will have. It is would have. So, okay. Let's go to the next sentence. If you lend him a book, he will lend it to someone and never you will get it back. But it is a wrong sentence. And the correct sentence is, if you lend him a book, he will lend it to someone and you will never get it back. So, it is a correct. So, now let us move on to the next wrong sentence and it goes like that. Uh, my father is in bad mood today. My father is in bad mood today. It is the wrong sentence. So, its correct sentence is, my father is in a bad mood today. My father is in a bad mood today. Okay, let us move on to the next sentence. And that is wrong sentence. And it says that, you can get all the information that you want. But it is a wrong sentence. You can get all the information that you want. And its correct sentence is, you can get all the information you want. You can get all the information you want. Okay, now let's move on to the next wrong sentence. And it goes like that. The students were awaiting for the arrival of the chief guest. The students were awaiting for the arrival of the chief guest. It is a wrong sentence. And its correct sentence is, the students were awaiting the arrival of the chief guest. So, let's talk about another wrong sentence and it, is, and it says that I have got my MSc degree in 1988. I have got my MSc degree in 1988. So, it is a wrong sentence and this correct sentence is I got my MSc degree in 1988. I got my MSc degree in 1988. Okay, now let's move on to the next wrong sentence. He will certainly help you if you will ask him in a pleasant manner. But, and its correct sentence is, he will certainly help you if you ask him in a pleasant manner. Okay, now let's move on to the next wrong sentence. And it says that, may I know who you want to see please? May I know who you want to see please? It's a wrong sentence. And its correct sentence is, may I know whom you want to see please? May I know whom you want to see, please? Okay, now let's move on to the next sentence. He said that he will mind if I refused his offer. If I refused his offer. And its correct sentence is, He said that he would mind if I refused his offer. He said that he would mind if I refused his offer. Okay, now let's move on to the next wrong sentence. And it says that the reason Ram is absent from his duty is because he is unwell. Okay, now let's talk, now let's talk about the correct sentence. And the correct sentence is, the reason why Ram is absent from his duty is because he is unwell. 
Okay, now let's talk about the next wrong sentence. And it says that Mr. Ramesh Regni is not attending his office for the last one month. Mr. Ramesh Regni is not attending his office for the last one month. It's a wrong sentence. And its correct sentence is Mr. Ramesh Regni has not been attending his office for the last one month. Mr. Ramesh Regni has not been attending his office for the last one month. Okay, now let's move on to the next wrong sentence. And it says that Arun's parent died when he was young and he looked after his aunt who had who had no children. And its correct sentence is Arun's parent died when he was young and he was looked after by his aunt who had no children. So thank you for watching this 15 wrong sentence and 15 correct sentence and we will talk about uh, something else in the another video thank you for watching this video